Hey guys, Center69046 here, and I'm back with another episode of Tornado Survival, Season 7, Episode 10. And in today's episode, we're going to try to do some storm chasing. But before we do that, I need to show off the fully decorated farms. So here's our crop variety farm, I guess. We got wheat and potatoes in here, the main two main crops in this game, really. Um, I've decided to do corner posts. Couldn't do a corner post there, obviously. But the roof, I decided to do a little, you know, a little texture to it, I guess. Um, let me know what you guys think about this. It's not completely done yet because I still got to do this back wall here. If I destroy that, wiring goes down, the whole lamp system goes down, all these crops pop up, and they're obviously not done growing yet. So once I, once these are done growing, we'll finish that one. Next up, we have just over here the sugarcane farm. And here I just, I did planks, this, used that block. Actually, this should really just be like that, you know? That'll despawn or go into my inventory. That'll work too. Um, hold on, let me <laughs> let me just plant this real quick. A little low on sugar cane, but don't worry, don't fret. Not an issue. <laughs> and this is the design I went with here. I kind of like it. It works. These colors blend together. Really, this is when I started playing Minecraft. These were the main blocks you use. So if you notice, I stick with this design a lot. <laughs> so there it is. You hit this button. And you know. There you go. Um, next is a spider farm, but before we do that, where are those diamonds we got last episode? We're going to mine these babies. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. With our fortune three pick. Here goes nothing. Two from that one. Two from that one. One from that one. One from that one. Wow, that was pretty garbage. That puts us up to 11 diamonds, though, and we might be able to do an enchant this episode. Who knows? Moving on, we're going to check out the spider farm. And with the spider farm, I just kind of continued on the dungeon idea and used the mossy cobble that we had gotten with it and basically just did a random pattern of cobble and mossy cobble, as you can see right here. Ah, I like it. Just don't look out that way. <laughs> Some, uh, it's a little, little not mossy cobble, maybe. It'll be alright, though. And with this, if we get spiders to spawn, they'll give them a second there. They're a little impatient sometimes. Hold on, we might have to tear down our own, our own stuff here just so I can see that. Um, come on, spiders. I know I'm in range. What the heck? Nice. You can't see a chest or there. Fix your mod, Koros. Um, so here I have this hop these hoppers pick up the spider string and put it in here. There you go. For some reason spiders aren't spawning. Oh there they go. Dang it. Freaking thing there it goes. And they should be able to spawn in right there. And the string will go in there, and that's how this works. Alright, now we're going to wait for a storm to spawn. I'll probably go AFK here while waiting. So um, I'll cut back in when we get a storm. Okay, it's 4.15. Look how long I've been sitting here. There's almost there's two stacks of string in this chest now, and I have not gotten us another storm to spawn. So I give in. I'm cheating. Get over it. It's not like it'll have any special abilities, just like a random spawning storm. Just so happens it spawns right above us though. So, we're just gonna get in our horse, and we're gonna go chase this cheaty storm. Cause I am not waiting any longer. I have stuff to do tomorrow, and I have to edit a video tonight. So, I'm not waiting. Okay, if you have any problems with that, just leave it in the comment section below. Yeah, alright. So there's stuff to talk about. My fan server is struggling. I upgraded to 4 gigabytes. It's still struggling. We had to turn mob spawns off because, um, yeah, it's struggling that much. <laughs> it's lagging really bad. I don't, I don't know what to do. I'm tempted to 
can do it off my own computer or build a computer to host it off of or something. You know? That's that's what we're looking at. Oh, look, a storm. Yeah, no way. Because what, I don't know, server hosts just aren't going to do it. There's too many plugins behind it, too many people on the server. But right now, it's just mobs are off and it's all right. So, but I really want mobs to be on. So, hopefully, I can get it working to where mobs will be on. So, that's, that's what our server is looking like right now. Is it just going to just gonna sit there? You can upgrade at any time. Come on. God, I'm going to have to wait longer. Well, it at least made it to a wall cloud. I'll give it that. Now we're talking. We got hail with it, which indicates that it's strengthening. So while we're doing this, let me just go ahead and tell a story. Because I have a pretty interesting weather-related story to tell. So I'm pretty sure I already mentioned my... Well, I did the drone video where my grandparents' house was hit by... Not hit, but a tornado passed very, 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 very close to my grandparents' house. Probably a few hundred yards away. And... um. I was going to do a separate video because the National Weather Service's path was way off from my path that I had found with my drone, and I was 95% sure that my path was correct, so I was going to make a video explaining why my path was correct and theirs was wrong, but I emailed them, showed them all the information that I had gathered, and they changed it, and they admitted that they were unsure of the path at first, but um, uh, with my... Um, uh, with my pictures and stuff, they were able to change it, and then they credited me with helping them find the correct path. So that's pretty cool. And the best part is, I got um, uh, invited to tour the National Weather Service's office in Louisville, which I will probably accept their offer on. All right, let's um, uh, let's see what this does. Yeah, that's 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 a cool story of the day. Another thing is, I'm going to have a new series coming to this channel. Maybe two, honestly, because I started playing Astroneer. That game is awesome. I'm considering recording and uploading that. Maybe single player, maybe multiplayer. I don't know. But that game is awesome. But the series that's definitely coming is Minecraft Tornado Survival SMP server. Kind of like the Minecraft server, but it's with the Tornado mod, basically. We have a few confirmed members. Me, Poisonous Cookie, Purple Viking, Gaming Yoshi... 26 Jupiterium and Fire Resistance 27. That's the members we have confirmed at this moment. I don't think I left anyone. Out. Oh crap! I left Shooter Brady out. Shooter Brady's in it too. Is that it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Yeah. All right. That's all. Ooh, great rotations tightening up on it. Let's move in closer, shall we? Because it'll take off on us if we don't. And it's basically just gonna be like the Minecraft server, but with the Tornado Mod and us seven people. We might add more people. I doubt it. Unless Mike wants to start doing it, but I doubt he will. Oh, look, we have a kind of sitting funnel here about the touchdown. Weak tornado. A rope, as is. Hello, cows. That's a good thing it's nighttime. That was a weird noise. I don't know what made that noise, but anyways. Ooh, we have some CG striking nearby. Let's avoid the citizens of Oklahoma there and move in on this thing oh we got rain great gotta love the rain mm, look at this okay wait a minute I have issues that was cyclonic that tornado as an F0 EF0 was spinning Cyclonic. Hey, a village. Ooh, ooh, thumbnail, thumbnail. That was spinning cyclonic. It is. It's look cyclonic. It's spinning counterclockwise. But if it strengthens to an F0 e or EF1, I'm pretty sure it's going to start spinning clockwise, which would be an issue. It's not going to. It's, it's That's all it is. But still, Koros, fix your mod. By the way, we can zoom in. Oh yeah, look at the looks at the suction vortices on that EF zero. <laughs> oh man, look at it roping. Oh donkeys, you know. Oh rip horsey, rip spiders. Oh yeah, look at it rip up those leaves. Mm. 
There you go. Uh oh. What is this, a crater? Oh, it's a nice sized crater, too. Are those horses gonna get sucked in? No, I don't think so. Oh, there we go, ladies and gentlemen. This appears to be lifting. The tornado is lifting. Yep. Alright. Funnel is not fully condensed and it appears to be weakening. No damage seen. The tornado has picked up. Now it's just a funnel on a weakening supercell that probably merged with the squall line or something and turned into a giant derecho MG. Who cares? Move on to this village and see what was in this um uh Oh yeah, direct hit on the village. This poor little village. Oh well. Let's see what they got in this um uh, blacksmith here. I like free stuff. It's only free because I'm stealing. But I still like free stuff. Ooh, I'll have to snag that. Hello. Where did that lava come from? Ooh, obsidian. That'll save me some time. Hey, if you cannot do that, you stupid lady. Ow. Why did I throw gold out? Okay, listen here. Run, horsey. We have issues. Panic. How much poison did she get us with? I gotta get off my horse, because if my horse gets shot, he's dead. Gosh. Do you eat carrots? No. He eats apples, though, right? No, he's not going to do it. All right. Well, that's that. Let's see if we can get the um, uh, books out of here. Oh, are you kidding me? Is it really this close to my village? That village is this close to this village? Really? Don't hit my horse. Huh. No, this is a separate village. Interesting. Anyways, that's going to do it. Like, comment, subscribe if you all enjoyed. And I'm going to see you all in the next one. This channel has a bright future. Just kidding. Psych!